Hi, I'm sorry. My name is Rob Brio. I just get so excited. I want to share with you. I forget to, to go through the preliminary sometime. Um, one of the things I want to share with you today is one of the ways that you can walk in revelation knowledge of laying hands on people and seeing them healed is by realizing um, one of the scriptures the Lord showed me and to help me walk in that authority. Um, which we're all supposed to do is the scripture that says that Paul says in uh, the book of Acts he says um, why do you look on me as though by my own holiness I've healed this man but he's been healed through faith in the name of Jesus um, so what God showed me in this revelation is people are not healed when you lay hands on them because you behave right or act right they're healed because you believe right because you believe in the name of Jesus and everything that he's done um, the, and it also says that the working of miracles is by faith not by works so a lot, a, a, quite a few years ago when the revival was going on in Pens Pensacola Florida and Todd Bentley was uh, the revivalist and doing signs wonders and miracles um, from his meeting and he has tattoos all over the place and religious people have a problem with that and then in the process of time they found out that you know he was unfaithful to his wife and while he was being unfaithful to his wife he was still walking in God's power people were still getting healed as he was preaching the word and people were still being um, set free delivered raised from the dead and people would get angry and said that he was a false prophet well I have news for you he was not a false prophet because the gifts and the calling of God, of God are without without he doesn't take them back okay he gives them to you and he wants you to walk in that presence and that power. His sin was just more obvious to the world than our sin is. All of us sin. We make mistakes and we sin, whether we know it or don't know it. it was, his was more obvious. And he was walking in signs, wonders, and miracles, not because he was a, 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 a godly person, not because he didn't sin, not because of um, his own holiness, but because he had faith in the name of Jesus and he believed in signs, wonders, and miracles and in the name of Jesus, not because he was holy uh, and behaved right, but because he was the righteousness of God through Jesus, not by his work. So, if you get offended at somebody who's doing signs, wonders, and miracles and their life is less than perfect, you lose out because you could be doing the exact same thing. And, um, it's not by our own holiness that we do signs, wonders, and miracles. It's because we are the righteousness of God. He became sin that we could become righteousness. And it, the working of miracles, signs, and wonders is through faith. And that is believing in the name of Jesus and the finished work on the cross. So my name is Rob Bramer. .net is the website. And um, I'll talk to you tomorrow. I hope that's been a blessing.